it was time to celebrate a 50-year milestone. And the ANC came out in style to salute the organization that is uniting Africa. President Zuma took to the podium in song before praising Africa for being the fastest growing region in the world. But he said in order to sustain economic development on the continent, African countries must speak in one voice. We must do everything we can do to prevent Africa from being cheaply auctioned as a result of as a result of the ineptitude and lack of unite, united action and resolve on the part of some of its leaders. He said African leaders have agreed that in order to achieve greater integration between the African countries, infrastructure is key. Roads, bridges, rail lines, pipelines, power pylons and plants, ICT, connectivity, cables, ports and waterways are the underpinning arteries of growth. Heads of states have been identified to champion infrastructure projects around the continent. Our view as heads of states is that we should soften the borders, if not really make Africans travel free instead of these borders that my brother explained that they were created after the Berlin conference. Zuma says the African continent will be a world player by 2063, but warns Africa can't develop unless there is peace on the continent. Sandy McCowan, East London, Eastern Cape. News that moves. ENCA.com.